YouTube, what's up? It's your boy who's King Sean, and we back again with another classic. You know, on this channel, we talk about business credit, we talk about personal credit, we talk about anything to take you and your family to the next level. So I'm going to show you the best vendors you can add on your business credit, and that will report within the first 30 to 45 days. Now I'm going to tell you the steps you need to do, and the steps is going to be the same for each of the ones I'm going to show you. The first thing you need to do is if you're here at Quail, Quail.com, you're going to call, get their phone number, you're going to call them up, and you're going to tell them clearly, I just started my LLC, I have a small business I just started, and I would like to start a net 30 business account with y'all. Let me say it clearly because people ask me the same question. You will get on the phone with customer service and tell them you would like to start a net 30 business account with them because if you don't clarify that, they will start you with a personal account and not a net 30 business account. They will ask you a couple questions about your business. Your personal information is simple. You could get them done within five minutes, each of them, if you want to. So um, just to let you know about Quail, Quail right here, um, I've, I've been using them for a while. <clears throat> You could buy uh, home supplies, office supplies. Um, usually when I buy stuff, I buy things like, you know, um, rolls of uh, toilet paper, uh, toilet tissue, um, Tide laundry detergent. That's what usually what I buy. Now, I want to let you know, um, you could buy whatever you want. You know, like I said, they got office supplies, things you might need for your business. But I'm going to let you know this clearly. You need to spend at least... A hundred dollars minimum <clears throat> for it to be reporting to your business credit. If you try to go and buy something for five dollars, ten dollars, fifteen dollars, it will not be reporting to your business credit. Just to let you know, you need to spend at least a hundred dollars. I'm gonna try to go through this a little fast. Pretty simple. Next one on the list is Zorro. Z O R O. Pretty much the same. You could buy a whole bunch of you know, office supplies, um, electrical supplies, food supplies, outdoor supplies, all kind of things. Um, you just look through, like I said, you're going to call them up. You're going to let them know you want to apply for a net 30 business account with them. Give them your little information. They'll set you up. And then from then is that you'll go, let's say you go on the site. Once they set up everything, um, you will go You'll pick what you need to pick. Now with Zorro, you need to spend at least $50 or more. <clears throat> Excuse me, my allergies mess with me. You need to spend at least $50 or more for them to be reporting to the business credit. So once you order it, so let's say today you order whatever you need to order from them, right? Um, They will send the supplies to your home, whatever it may be. Once you get that in your home, Remember, you are a business now, so they're going to invoice you to your email. The invoice will come in. It'll say you owe us $50, $60, $70, $80, $100. You, at that point, you will pay it. You could pay it then, or sometimes all of them is different. They'll say you got to pay in seven days, 10 days, 14 days, or even 30 days. What I usually do when I started off and I really wanted to grow my business scores, as soon as I got them invoices, I made those payments clear, simple. Let's move along. Crown Office Supplies. Now, Crown Office Supplies is another good one. And with them, you could buy like T-shirts. If you're trying to promote your company, if you got a channel, if you got a business, cleaning business, if you got an air conditioning business, whatever you want, you could go on there and you could get things designed and stuff for your business. And with them, you know, they want you to spend at least $100 or more. Simple and easy. Nothing to break your, your head about. Next one, we're going to go the Sumo Office Supplies. And with them, they sell a lot of supplies too. Um, I actually haven't dealt with Sumo, but um, they're a real good company. Um, so you could go in there. You'll do the same steps again. Call them up. Set up a Net30 business account. Uh, once you're set up and they give you your account number, at that time, you will go ahead, go right online. Buy some things, they invoice it, you pay it in 30 days, they report it to the credit bureau. Very simple and very easy. Once again, Granger. Granger was one of my favorite out of all 
Um, I think I bought some outside patio stuff with them, some light fixtures. I got a bunch of lights around my house. I bought some lights, just little, you know, little stupid things that I needed when I first started off. And um, you can see all their products right here, man. Grange is my favorite. You can see everything. They sell batteries, fleet, uh, vehicle maintenance, furniture, you know, air conditioner supplies, lighting, um, all kinds of outdoor stuff, power transmission, and plumbing stuff. I mean, anything possible you could get with Granger. Granger, when I actually did the purchase, you got to spend at least $100 and more. Not $98, not $99. All these got to be Cephazaro. Um, 100 and plus. So 103, 105, and stuff like that. You will have to spend for them to report. And they actually reported in like less than three weeks. Um, they report faithfully all the time. They are a great company. I definitely recommend them. Um, next one we're going to go to <clears throat> is New Egg Business. Now, with them, you could call them up and they'll start a credit line with you. Um, they'll work something out, you know, that is comfortable for you that you could pay back. And again, it's the same steps. They will invoice you at the time and then you will pay it off. Very easy, very simple. Some of these a lot of people don't know about. Um, I'm bringing you the new good ones. Um, but you know, Granger being my favorite, it definitely got to be in there. Um, next one is Uline. At one point, a couple years back, Uline probably was the best company to deal with when it comes to vendors reporting to your business side. Now, Uline changed a lot over the years. I don't recommend Uline at all. I'm gonna make it clear. I do not recommend Uline at all. All, let me make it clear. The reason why, one point, you could order one item, $50 or more, <clears throat> and they were reported to your business side. Then it came to a point where you had to spend $100 or more for them to report. Then they changed it up where you had to buy three separate items. So you will order item, they will invoice it, you will pay. Another item, invoice you pay. Another item, invoice you, and then you pay. Then they will report it. So um, just imagine if you spend $100 invoice, $100 invoice, another $100 invoice. That's over $300 before they report it one time to your credit bureau. But guess what? What Uline did in the past five to six months. For them to report a business, um, any kind of transactions with them, you have to do five to six transactions now. So now you're looking at about five to six hundred dollars before they report one time. So a lot of people is having problems. I do one on one with people. If you want a one on one, you can hit me in the Instagram and I'll get back to you and we'll lock in on the personal side or the business side. But a lot of people are doing Uline because Uline was kind of like one of the beginning ones that got very popular. A lot of people used to be using Uline um, for a vendor to report to your business side. But like I said, um, they kind of got hip to people buying little um, things and then not messing with them again. They, like I said, they went up to three separate ones. Now they're up to five to six. So um, it's not worth it. I never recommend a lot of people I do one-on-ones ask about this and I always tell them. Please don't do that. You'll be waiting around six to eight months before they report one time. So, again, people, we're going to cross off Uline. You could do the new egg business. If you don't know no information about it, again, like I said, how I started, I will get on the phone and be with these people for an hour with customer service, and I will get all the information Please have all the information and all the questions you have when you ask them. So if you need to say, hey, how much do I need to spend? Because with these vendors, they change daily. So like, let's say Granger, you need to spend $100 or more. Um, it might be like that for five months. Next thing you know, they might say $125 or more, $150. So all the information I'm giving you is up to date to today, October, but Next month, December 2023, things are changed. Things change daily. So please do your home homework. No matter what people tell you, do your own homework. Um, like I said, the Sumo Office, you could deal with them. The Crown Office Supplies, I, um, 
You could deal with them. Desaro was one of my beginners I used when I was building business credit for my tier ones. And um, Quail and Granger actually being my, my favorite than Zorro right behind. So again, people, it's up to y'all to do the work. I just gave you a bunch of vendors. If you want to build your business side and your business score, you could contact all these companies. Very simple. You're going to say the same thing. You would like to open a net 30 business account with them. They'll tell you the steps. You get all the, you know, you'll give them all your information. They'll set you up and go ahead and start your process so you can start building that business side. A lot of people think you just get business credit by just saying, hey, I'm apply for a business credit card. Oh, I got approved. Oh, I don't need to do tier ones. I don't need to do tier twos. If you want to learn about these different tiers, hit me in the comments and we'll start working on that. But for now, we need to work on tier ones and that's online vendors for your business so you can make it grow. So again, big people, I appreciate all your support. Like, comment, subscribe. But for now, I'm up out of here. Peace.